Simon Edoche is a supporter of Tinubu government. Some of you will think that a lot of people started disliking you because he got married to Judy. No. Some people have their political reason why they started disliking this young man. This young man did not only bring himself down with the with the strange love with a strange woman. It also affects his political career. Listen, Yon Edoshe made this post on his Instagram page and also on his Facebook verified account. He said, as a leader, you will see certain things that your people may never see. You will have access to certain information that your people may never have access to. So some of your decisions may not be fully understood by the people even though they are in the best interest of the people you have my support mr president sir i know you are a man of wisdom may god guide you in all the decisions you take for nigeria best wishes mr president the jagabar look at it though i'm reading from his page so are you are we are we even put it on this video see your leadership made his post doing what? Praising Tinubu in this critical time. Nigerians are weeping over the hike of food prices, hike of fuel price, inflation is eating up ev everyone. Your leadership is writing an episode. An episode to do what? To praise Tinubu for a job well done, that he's taking the best decision for his people. You see, I don't know how much they gave to him, but trust me, I noticed all this kind of character from you since the campaign, during the campaign. Yes, humans have a different political ideology, different political wings, but does that stop us from knowing what is right now? You see, take a good look at it. During the time of campaign, your leadership indirectly tried everything possible to bring Peter be down with his followers. Your leadership tried everything possible to do what? To bring Peter be down, to show how he is not supporting Peter B. But because he knew that if he had pushed it so, so much hard, people would give it back to him. Your leadership is that respected. This one is not it's not about ethnicity and all that. But let's just be factual. Since Tinubu, Tinubu started ruling, what good has happened to Nigeria? What good, what good news have we wish what is the good news that has ever come out since Tinubu started ruling? What is the good news? What exactly have we enjoyed since he started ruling? Since he became the president, what good news have we received as Nigerians? What good thing are we enjoying as Nigerians? Currently, Tinubu is doing everything possible to go and fight the Nigerians. With the name of ECOWAS and all that, Tinubu is writing to the Senate to approve Nigerian forests to go and fight the death of Niger. What kind of best decision is that? We have a lot of problem that is troubling us as Nigerians. Tinubu overlooked all that. He wants to go and start fighting in Niger. So what decision has he made that is of the best interest of Nigerians? I don't know how much they paid you on the like I said earlier, but this crazy, I don't care, I don't send attitude is so bad. I wish someone, a loved one to him, I wish someone that loved him or someone he loved would call him and give him a good advice. He has killed his political career, not just loving a strange woman and throwing his legal wife outside, by, but by also supporting a government that the youth are not in support of government that is not of the interest of the youth not of the interest of the people but of for their self your leadership is son of a legend nobody would ever believe that you will stoop so low to support bad government his father has shown this strong man a man of integrity a man that knows his class his word a man of caliber a man like an icon that a whole lot of young men are looking up to 
we didn't know that Sape Tedoche would produce a son like Yo Lidoche. We, we, we have no idea that Yo Lidoche would turn to something that even his fans, his family would not be able to explain. During the interview with the father, the father clearly states that he was not aware that Yo is going out to pick a second wife. That, they, they, that nobody knew of it. And that confirms what May said that she don't know that her husband is getting married to a second wife. That she just saw the whole thing on social media. And she was shocked. Do you understand? So how come you, all of a sudden, he decided to change to something that even we fans, we are not able to explain the young man we know today. Yoli Doshi is publicly supporting Tinubu for what? Which decision? Even if you love him so much, why can't you speak on behalf of those people that have no voice, that have no platform to speak for themselves? Why don't you use your platform and make it useful to people? Why don't you call upon him on certain things he should do, on certain things that are important? Look, don't you see how Ponga is killing everybody? Don't you see how people are, are, are eating from hand to mouth? Don't you see how inflation is rising? Don't you see the cost price of fuel? Don't you see that not everybody can afford it? Why can't you talk about social things that really matters? You are hailing him for decision. What decision exactly? How much did they pay you to make that post you own? Why did you prefer to sell your integrity for a token? You own how well, how much, how much did they pay you? Why did you choose to sell your, your self-respect? You, you used to be my favorite Nollywood actor, but today, you are not a watch your video again. Like, why do I have to watch your video when you have lost, like you have lost the respect people have for you? Not only betraying your wife, but betraying the whole of Nigerians by supporting the wrong government. Yo, your brother, Pitobi, you tried everything possible to bring Pitobi down. But even if you don't support Labour Party, then why don't you just ignore him than, than trying to bring P2B down? During his birthday, you never wished him one. During the time of campaign, you never posted P2B even for one. The only time you posted P2B is to make mockery of him. You know P2B have this, should I say, small kind of tone. There's a way he, there's a way he speak. I, 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 I think in one language they call it Obelono, like it's kind of, kind of small tone. Or a kind of not clear, not this clear to So, Peter, uh, your lady just start making mockery of him by producing one stupid movie. In the movie, it was all nonsense. I mean, nonsense upon nonsense. Iberibe upon Iberiberism. That was the best way to describe the movie. Your lady just, it was his movie. He posted this movie. He was promoting this movie. And he was making mockery of Peck. Of um, and he was making mockery of Peter, Mr. Peter, Obi. and that is the height of it. You, how much did they pay you? How much were you paid? You sold your the, the future of your kids, life of younger people, of your fans, the people that love you, the people that have supported you, the people that bring you this far. You sold everything for a token. Nothing lasts forever. Very, very soon, now you and your second wife will start pushing towards that uh, everybody should leave. Less love more, less live more. Nothing lasts forever. Yes, but some of you do not really do what you preach. You don't do it.